Here's a hard health truth you probably don't want to hear. That cozy bedroom humidifier might be feeding dust mites, and it's blasting bacteria into the air you sleep in. Dust mites don't drink water. They pull moisture from the air. Once your bedroom humidity climbs past about 50%, mite survival and allergen levels spike. More humidity means more mites. More mites means more allergens in your mattress, pillows, and carpet. And this isn't theory. In real homes, keeping humidity levels below 50% led to major drops in live mites and dust mite allergens. Now here's the second problem though. It's the humidifier itself. If you're using an ultrasonic humidifier and not cleaning it, you're aerosolizing whatever's growing in that tank. That's bacteria, mold fragments, biofilm. And if you're using tap water, that chalky white dust, that's mineral aerosol you're breathing. This is where things like humidifier fever come from. It's flu-like symptoms after inhaling contaminated mist. And in some cases, repeated exposure can trigger what's known as humidifier lung, where your immune system inflames your lungs. Here's the simple fix though. Buy a cheap hygrometer. Keep humidity between 30 and 50%. Use distilled water. Clean the tank or just don't run it. You don't need to throw out your humidifier. Just stop turning your bedroom into a tropical ecosystem with a mist cannon. That's your hard health truth for the day. Sources are down in the description. Follow for more.